Hi guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to track multiple objects with 100% accuracy in After Effects easy and quick. I will use these three footage and one YouTube logo to show you how to track them all in your one video. First of all let's click on track camera. As the analyzing is done, I will select some points in the background, because I want one of my footage to be tracked right there. Once you have selected tracking points, right click on them and select create solid in camera. Since I have four elements that I want to track in my video, I will create three more solid in cameras, one I will create here. Let's scroll forward a bit and another one I will create somewhere here. And the last one let's create here. So now I have four track solids and now I can simply drag and drop my footage here and track them, but before let's rename those track solid layers. I will name them the same as my footage, I name solids just not to mess up solid in the footage layers, with the same names, you will always know which solid is linked to the footage and it will make you easy to find the solid or a footage you will need later for a changes or any other reason. So this one in the background I will rename to tornado, because I'm going to track tornado footage there. On that green one I will track an electric arc footage, so let's rename it to electric arc. Now simply rename other solids and once you are done, we can drag and drop the footage and track them. I will begin with tornado effect. Once you have dropped your footage, make sure to enable 3D on that layer, in my case it's tornado. Now let's select tornado solid layer and press P on your keyboard to open position on it. Copy that position and then paste it on a tornado footage. Now press S on tornado footage layer and let's scale it, then let's correct position and rotations if needed. As you see my tornado layer is right there where I have create a solid in camera and it's tracked 100% accurately. Just note, when you paste the position from a track solid on a footage, do not mess up with the Z position or it will be messed up, I don't mean that a slight change can ruin it, but if you change Z position too much, then it won't be tracked perfectly. And once you are happy with the tracked footage, make sure to toggle off a track solid layer. And now we can drag and drop another footage. I will drop an electric arc and simply do the same steps. Let's enable 3D on it and then select electric arc solid layer and press P on your keyboard. Now copy position and paste it on an electric arc footage. Let's slightly reposition it and once you are happy with it, toggle off track solid layer and let's check it, but before, I will stretch it a bit cause this footage is a bit short. Right click on it, go to time and click on time stretch. I will change stretch factor to 200. Now let's check it. Nice, as you see I have perfectly tracked two footage with a very simple and a basic steps. All you have to do is, do the same steps on all other footage that you want to track, make sure to create camera and solids for every footage that you are going to track and you will get this smoothest tracked video with very easy steps. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.